universe will not forget it. The universe can never forget what you want. So the most important thing for you to do to manifest something is to understand that well, as soon as you think about it and you visualize it, it's imprinted in the universe. When, that, when it's imprinted in the universe, now the universe will bring it to you. See, many of us, what we do is when we manifest something, we desire something, we keep harping on it. We keep thinking of how it's going to come. Is it going to come? The universe doesn't work that way. So once you understand that, and this is the most important thing for you to do, is now to become less reactive to circumstances in your environment, to become less attached to your thoughts and feelings, to become more present. By being present, you are now allowing what's already yours to come to you. So let me show you, because I think you guys know that, but let me, I have to replay this and show you. The way things work is every single thing you want is entangled. Time works like a plane, past, present, future, all here at the same time. That means every single thing you desire is here right now in the same moment. It may just be a little different coordinates right over there, but if you can go above the plane, you can see that your desires. That's important to understand because our minds will trick us otherwise and say, well, it's not here. I can't see it. It's not possible. That's your ego conditioned mind. So when things are manifesting, you have to let it play its part. You can visualize, but don't overdo it. You can do affirmations, but don't overdo it. Just do them because they make you feel good or do them because they raise your vibration. Don't do them because you need them to manifest your desires. If the things you want is in the mind, it's in your intention. If it's in your heart, the universe got it. It's etched in there. You just have to now follow the creative process. So the creative process involves a belief, faith, and letting go. Once you can do that, everything you desire will come to you in divine timing. Divine timing basically means the right time that your higher self, everything is set up for you to experience it. Because remember, again, you have a higher version of you and it can see your entire map. It sees your entire timeline so it knows where the pitfalls are, where's the best situations. See, your regular mind can't see that. Your regular mind can only see tic tacs, like little bits, bit, 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 bit. But if, if you're looking at a plane, you can see the entire plane. That's you, there's a version of you like that. Communicates you through your intuition, etc. So when you understand that, your job now, and I said again, the most important thing for you to do to manifest something is to be present and pay less attention to reactions and emotions and just observe things as is keyword as is okay that's that's the way you're going to free things up to come into your life that's the way you're going to uh, push away a lot of resistance that's the way you're going to get your ego under control and that's the way you're going to manifest things so much easier and so much more with effortlessly because what you're actually doing now you're actually now in accordance with how the universe works we're actually in what I call that flow state. Because think about this. Anything and everything you want is here right now. If it's here right now, the only thing that ever exists is this moment. This moment I'm speaking to you. Everything can only come in now. Your thoughts are gonna come in this moment. Your visions come in this moment. So if you understand that, then you gotta understand, okay, what's the only thing I have to deal with? my thoughts and my emotions, which is primarily generated by what? My ego or my unconscious mind. What are these thoughts and emotions? Feelings, illusions, not happening right now. They just give me feelings. My mind projects something to happen. So what do you do? If you know what you want, you observe these thoughts and you have less reaction to them, less reaction, more vibration raised, effortless manifestation. So again, I gotta stress this because I think a lot of individuals miss this part. When they manifest stuff, they don't think that the universe knows. They think they got. It's, they think it's their job to remind the universe. It's not your job to remind the universe. It's not your job to tell the universe how. That's the, that's the biggest thing we face because it, that's just how our minds work. Our brains work that way. Our brains want to figure out. All right, how am I gonna get this? 
All right, you can't do that. You gotta stop all that, guys. You just have to know that from the minute you want something, the universe can never forget it. Visualize when you feel like, affirm it when you do it, but don't do affirmations or visualize because you feel you need to do it or you feel like it has to because you're gonna create resistance. Do these things to help to raise your vibration to what you want. Because what manifests really is how present you are and that state of being of being less reactive to your thoughts and emotions. The less reactive you are to these thoughts and emotions, the more you're able to allow that thing to manifest effortlessly. Because remember, it's there already. Everything exists right here, but because when it exists, you know, there's different densities of energies. High, low. Remember, energy pushes and pulls. So think about it. If you can get the less energy, that thing will move a lot, right? And then you, you start to worry, you start to doubt, and you dig yourself deeper into a deeper hole. You want to avoid all of that. So my secret when I manifest stuff is, I kind of like, my motto, I kind of like set it and forget it. Meaning that I know what I want, I decide it, I let it go, I'll visualize it, I'll affirm it when I feel like it. Okay? And once I do that, then my main focus is I am primarily focused in on how I'm feeling in the moment. Do that, you'll manifest it easy and effortless.